The Electronic Entertainment Expo 2015 was the 21st Electronic Entertainment Expo held. The event took place at the Los Angeles Convention Center in Los Angeles, California. It began on June 16, 2015, and ended on June 18, 2015, with 52,200 total attendees. Major exhibitors at the convention included Activision Blizzard, Atlas, Bethesda Softworks, Electronic Arts, Microsoft Studios, Nintendo, Nvidia, Sony Computer Entertainment, Square Enix and Ubisoft. While E3 is a closed event to only members of the video game industry and the media, the Entertainment Software Association (ESA) allowed access to the event from gamers for the first time by distributing 5,000 tickets to various exhibitors that they subsequently distributed to their fans. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Press conferences. Topic: <inaudible> 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 Oculus. Oculus VR hosted a pre-E3 press conference on June 11, 2015 at 10 a.m. During the conference, Oculus Rift's final design was revealed. Oculus Touch, a controller for the Rift, as well as exclusives, including damaged core from High Voltage Software, VR Sports Challenge from Sansaru Games, Cronus from Gunfire Games and Edge of Nowhere from Insomniac Games were announced. <laughs> Bethesda. Bethesda hosted its first ever E3 press conference on June 14 at 7 p.m. During the conference, Bethesda Softworks revealed Fallout Shelter, Dishonored, Definitive Edition, Dishonored 2, as well as The Elder Scrolls, Legends, a card game set within the Elder Scrolls universe. Release windows, trailers and gameplay demo were released for Fallout 4, Doom and Battlecree. Topic: Microsoft. Microsoft hosted a press conference on June 15 at 9:30 a.m. During the conference, Microsoft announced Recore, Xbox One backward compatibility, a new Elite controller, Plants vs Zombies, Garden Warfare 2, Dark Souls 3, Ashen, Beyond Eyes, Ion, Rare Replay, Sea of Thieves, and Gears of War Ultimate Edition, and showed footage of Halo 5, Guardians, Forza Motorsport 6, Fallout 4 with mod support, Tom Clancy's The Division. Tom Clancy's Rainbow Six Siege, Gigantic, Tacoma, Cuphead, Rise of the Tomb Raider, Fable Legends, a version of Minecraft compatible with Microsoft HoloLens and Gears of War 4. Electronic Arts Electronic Arts hosted a press conference on June 15 at 1 p.m. The conference lasted for an hour. During the conference, Electronic Arts announced Mass Effect Andromeda, showed gameplay of Need for Speed, announced the Star Wars, The Old Republic, Knights of the Fallen Empire, Unravel, showed gameplay of Plants vs Zombies, Garden Warfare 2, announced NHL 16, NBA Live 16, Star Wars, Galaxy of Heroes, Minions Paradise, showed footage of FIFA 16, showed gameplay of Mirror's Edge Catalyst, showed footage of Madden NFL 16 and showed gameplay of Star Wars Battlefront. Ubisoft Ubisoft hosted a press conference on June 15 at 3 p.m. During the conference, Ubisoft announced South Park, The Fractured But Whole, a new IP titled For Honor, The Crew Wild Run, Trials Fusion, Awesome Level Max, Anno 2205, Just Dance 2016, Trackmania Turbo and Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon Wildlands and showed gameplay of Tom Clancy's The Division, Tom Clancy's Rainbow Six Siege and Assassin's Creed Syndicate. Sony 
Sony hosted a press conference on June 15 at 6 p.m. During the conference, Sony re-announced The Last Guardian, announced a new IP titled Horizon Zero Dawn, Hitman, Dreams, Firewatch, Destiny, The Taken King, a Final Fantasy VII remake, and Shenmue III and showed footage of No Man's Sky, Assassin's Creed Syndicate, Batman, Arkham Knight, Call of Duty, Black Ops 3, Disney Infinity 3.0, Star Wars, Battlefront and Uncharted 4, A Thief's End. Topic Nintendo Nintendo, for a third consecutive E3, decided to forego hosting a traditional press conference in favor of a Nintendo Digital event, a pre-recorded video presentation that was streamed online on June 16 at 9 a.m. with an accompanying press release. Prior to E3, Nintendo also held an event, the Nintendo World Championships 2015 a competition in which a group of players participated in a multi-round competition across multiple Nintendo games, and also featured the announcement of new content for Super Smash Bros. for Nintendo 3DS and Wii U, Earthbound Beginnings, Blast Ball, and new gameplay of Super Mario Maker as part of the competition's finale. During the digital event, Nintendo announced Star Fox Zero, Amiibo figures compatible with Skylanders, Superchargers, The Legend of Zelda, Tri-Force Heroes, Hyrule Warriors Legends, Metroid Prime, Federation Force, Fire Emblem Fates, Tokyo Mirage Sessions Sharp Fay, showed footage of Xenoblade Chronicles X, announced Animal Crossing, Happy Home Designer, Animal Crossing, Amiibo Festival, showed footage of Yoshi's Woolly World, announced Yokai Watch, Mario & Luigi, Paper Jam, Mario Tennis, Ultra Smash and showed footage of Super Mario Maker. <laughs> Square Enix Square Enix hosted a press conference on June 16 at 10 a.m. During the conference, Square Enix announced Nier, Automata under the provisional title Nier New Project, Lara Croft Go, Kingdom Hearts Unchained Kai, Star Ocean, Integrity and Faithlessness and a new IP titled I Am Setsuna and showed footage of Just Cause 3, Rise of the Tomb Raider, Kingdom Hearts 3, World of Final Fantasy, Hitman and Deus Ex, Mankind Divided. Announcement footage of Final Fantasy VII Remake was revealed as part of Sony's presentation. <laughs> PC Gaming Show A webcast focusing on PC gaming was held on June 16 at 5 p.m. by gaming magazine PC Gamer and AMD, and hosted by Sean Plott. Representatives of studios including Blizzard Entertainment, Microsoft Studios, Bohemia Interactive, Paradox Interactive, Obsidian Entertainment, as well as Tripwire Interactive, ArenaNet, The Creative Assembly, Frictional Games, Frontier Developments, SCS Software, Splash Damage, Square Enix, Cloud Imperium Games and Devolver Digital made appearances. Rising Storm 2, Vietnam, a PC port of Killer Instinct, American Truck Simulator, a Pillars of Eternity expansion known as the White March, Planet Coaster and an expansion of Armor 3 known as Tanoa were announced, and there was footage shown of Killing Floor 2, Star Citizen, Deus Ex, Human Revolution, Total War, Warhammer, Fable Legends, Gigantic, Gears of War, Ultimate Edition, Eve Valkyrie, Ion, Strafe, The Guild Wars 2 expansion Heart of Thorns, Hitman, Soma, Day Z, Take on Mars, Blue Streak, Enter the Gungeon, and No Man's Sky. Topic: <laughs> List of notable exhibitors. This is a list of major video game exhibitors who made appearances at E3 2015. Topic. List of confirmed games This is a list of notable titles that appeared at E3 2015. Notes <laughs>